Hello everyone, it's Roman, the head of marketing at Render Forest. Uh, thanks a lot for joining this webinar as promised. Uh, today our guest, uh, Narek, who is the CEO of the company, Render Forest. Uh, by the way, it's an online video production uh, company, if you don't know about it. So, uh, our today's guest is Narek. Uh, so, Narek, please uh, introduce a little bit about yourself, about your experience. Uh, so our viewers know who you are and how you started uh, around the forest. Well, good evening. Thanks for organizing the interview. Uh, we started back in 2013. Mm. I have a degree in cinematography and when I graduated we decided with a couple of friends to launch a video production company to help various kind of startups and small businesses to help them create videos. Yes. Mostly, most of the startups have one problem. They do have little budget for uh, their video production. And the problem is, um, explainer video production, explainer animation production is very cost, yes. uh, expensive to produce. That's why we decided to find a cost effective solution by automating the industry. When we did research, uh, the solutions on the market were mostly automated. And they were based on, um, they delivered a quality which uh, could not consider as broadcast. And it's, it was similar to PowerPoint or some kind of software. Yes, so we yes. decided to launch a platform which will deliver standards to meet uh, broadcast quality formats. Yes. Uh, broadcast quality needs. So um, the Render First platform uh, idea was born in 2013. And we did about one and a half year development and we launched the platform in beta in 2014. Uh, and uh, we are growing rapidly over the last uh, two to three years. We have about uh, three million users now and five million videos have been created. The main goal was helping startups. First we started to create explainer animations for startup but then expanded our categories and now lots of uh, people who need mm, just various kinds of broadcast quality videos. DJs for music visualizations, for YouTubers, uh, right? yes, YouTubers for their intro, startups for their promotional videos. So it started as a help for startups but then yes. expanded and now we have lots of various kinds of users who daily create more than 10,000 videos. Yes. So currently we have about 5,000 uh, daily registrations of new users. 3 million user base and we are expanding expanding so our main idea started when mm, when we discovered that most of the startups do not have enough funding for creating their videos so yes. for startup the most important factor is explaining their idea with ease so uh, we decided to launch the platform which will help them the, to make their ideas mm, come into reality with this. Yes, and with low budget, right? Without spending uh, thousands of uh, dollars for yes, making... Yes, as you know, the explainer video production done by studios or uh, independent freelancers are very expensive. You should spend at least one to two thousand dollars in order to get high quality videos. Lots of startups do not own that money and they want cost-effective solution and the market has alternatives, sure, automated alternatives, which were in low quality. So we created Render Forest, which, which offers the same, uh, similar quality, which meets broadcast quality standards in a yes. price under 50 or 30 dollars. Yes, for single video. Yes, for single, for single one promotional video. Yes, awesome. So guys, uh, you all already have a background about what Render Forest is and as promised uh, for this webinar, we are going to talk about uh, the importance of videos uh, in general in any marketing campaign. So, uh, Narek, please uh, tell a bit about uh, this topic. Uh, why do you think that videos are one of the most important? Uh, videos are one of the most important uh, techniques for describing that is describing something and. Uh, um, what do you think, why are they so popular nowadays? Uh, well, based on uh, visual stats, over 80% of businesses who used videos yes. in their web page said that video helped to boost their conversion. As, as we know, people are more likely to watch videos rather than read 
lots of articles with full of text and images. When you when people watch, uh, you, when you have a video on your homepage or on your benefits page, people will spend more time on your website. What does that mean? First, uh, you will have more time to explain your idea to your viewer. Secondly, it has a positive factor on search engines. For example, for Google, the longer you are staying on a specific yes, website, right. it's a factor that pages that you are more effective and Google will bring Boost you to the traffic. first page. Yes. Also lots of businesses uh, say that when they have a video on their home page they their rankings and SEO traffic rises. Yes. Sure but uh, you you have to be very careful on video production. For example there are many kinds of videos which um, which you can create and publish on your home page. You should dis decide the right video based on your target audience. For yeah, example yeah. you can um, publish a tutorial video on your home page or maybe a promotional one or explain animation but which will work the best for your audience. In order to discover that you have to do research. Yes. First, uh, research your competitors. So, See what kind of videos they use on their homepage, on their website, and which one has the most views and the most uh, brand awareness. Uh, by comparing, you you can decide uh, what, kind of, what kind of video will work best for your business because the target audience of your competitors and yours is the same. Yeah. In that case, you will choose the right type of video and can publish on your website. But that uh, doesn't mean to duplicate the same video and uh, uh, so it should be unique. Uh, sure, well, uh, besides duplicating you, you have to create a unique and high quality video. Why quality mat matters? Because uh, another research says that when when you post a low quality video on your homepage, yes. your brand awareness uh, may go down. People uh, will likely to continue browsing your website, your services when they see an engaging, high-quality video. So the yeah, quality yeah. Ma matters. If so. if you care about your business reputation and uh, business future, you have to be very careful on video production. And choose something which will have better quality. So uh, in order uh, to create a video, um, we can maybe create how you are going to create mar marketing videos, right? Yes, sure, sure. So there are some kinds of videos. For example, and uh, based on your target audience, the, uh, the structure may be different. For example, for startups, uh, the most uh, used uh, solution which works great is not introducing your brand for the first minute of, the, of your video. Keeping yeah. your video under nine, uh, 90 or maximum two minutes. Uh, you are starting to showcase some problems in the market. The problems, statistics, reports, this is uh, this won't give your audience uh, ad feel. They won't feel the video is advertising. Yeah. Then sure. after one minute of interesting information when their um, yeah, your users are uh, interested in the video, you are presenting your company or startup and it's acting as a solution for the problem which you just explained uh, to your users. So it's very important uh, for startups not to start uh, pro promoting their own startups without, without interesting engaging facts and uh, interesting facts. But, but for other kind of industries that may work good. For example, for products. For products you may want elegant sleek video like most of the popular companies does you may start introducing your uh, product in live footage from the first seconds in that case it may work because yes. so because your target audience is different uh, they are going to buy products not services so you have to do a good research on your competitors and understand what kind of video will work best for your pr for your product or business also they testing testing may work so testing. yes yes uh, you can try different types of videos and understand which one affects uh, best for your users so okay. maybe uh, analyzing competitors is a very good idea but uh, maybe sometimes uh, you have something unique and uh, maybe the videos that you the one video that you see uh, on your competitor homepage for example uh, may not work uh, with your website so uh, you should uh, you should take on the consideration that statistics but 
Testing is always a good idea. Yes, so over the last three years we have been tested a few videos on our homepage. Or all of them have about one million views in total. So we just try to understand which kind of video will work best on our homepage. We yes. started with a short promotional video, 90 seconds long. It, it helped users to understand our idea and move deeply in the platform. Then we tried to experiment with a tutorial video, which was four to five minutes uh, yes. long. Long and we discovered that in our case, a long tutorial video works better because people want to uh, people are interested to create videos and they want to see the process. Yeah, how that's the reason the, uh, the mm -hmm. view amount uh, was about seventy to eighty percent of the total video, while the promotional one was fifty to sixty percent. So in our target audience, people were more likely to watch tutorial videos than a promotional ones. Also, it affected on conversions, and our yes. conversions rise a bit from from a new kind of video we published on our homepage. So it's very important to do A/B testing. Don't don't stuck on one video. Just try a few kinds of videos maybe you, you and finally you will compare which one uh, affects on your conversions and yeah you will change it so you have to take the same traffic uh, that is coming to your website and after changing the types of videos you can uh, simply just analyze uh, how users uh, how users interact with your videos on your website uh, yes the so businesses actually who do use explainer videos on their homepage reported that it affected on conversion yes, rates. Actually. So it's it's uh, over half of the businesses who used explainer video said that they will use new ones because it's, it's effects on conversions. Yeah, and uh, they, uh, they always try new types of videos, right? For example, explainers, promotionals, uh, footage based as you uh, call Yes, uh, there are lots of kinds of videos. You should understand whether you want the explainer video, yes. explainer animation, or you on some businesses you may want to create a promotional video based on real footages. For example, on RenderForce we have integration with video blogs, uh, which yes. have uh, over 100,000 stock footages, and you can just build a promotional video using uh, maybe uh, a toolkit which uh, which is more video editing one. For example, Broadcast Quality Toolkit, and you can edit uh, a stock a video based on stock footages which can be a promotional one. We created various kinds of videos and we do have uh, videos based on stock footages as well. They are effective too. So you should try to test with various kinds of videos to find out which one works best for best, you. Best. Right. Awesome. So uh, let's talk a little bit about uh, videos. Uh, how, uh, how videos actually help for boosting conversions of your website. So maybe uh, do you need one one video for your website or you need several ones for specific pages, for example, tutorial videos and uh, for tutorial section, why is it important to show your uh, tutorials to, uh, to present them in a video format, not text only? Okay, so based on our reputation and our experience, Animated videos, explain animations work best uh, for all kinds, for most kinds of businesses. Uh, businesses. They uh, they have simplicities. They um, have nostalgia. They have entertainment. They have engagement. It's fun and, uh, to watch. It's that fun kind of to videos. watch that kind of videos. For example, if you have an explain animation on your homepage, yes. and, and businesses go uh, and your clients are visiting your website, they will watch the video in <coughs> longer compared to a promotional video which will be just an interview or a stock footage based video yes this yes. Uh, that affects on seo so you will get have more traffic uh, which means you uh, your conversion may may rise also uh, the video explains about your business and product so the longer uh, user stays on your website while watching the video the, there are more sh chances that e uh, user will learn more about your business, so it affects on conversions. Uh, user may, may continue browsing your website and go deeper and deeper and may become a customer. So, based on uh, research, over 90% of users said they, they watched explainer videos when they see on the website. So, uh, videos affects a lot on conversions as well. And, um, there are lots of various samples over the internet which uh, you can use in some cases when you are not 
just creating an explainer promotional animation, but an explainer animation which starts with facts and is funny, engaging. Yes. It has more Useful chances content. to go for uh, virality. So people yes, share sure, it, sure. it drives more traffic, and it's kind of uh, uh, advertising of a brand. So besides uh, thinking about making the video to present your company or product or whatever you're doing, you can also think about make it, making it useful, entertainment and yeah. maybe the chance, uh, chances will go high for uh, it to become viral on the web. Yes. So more people will share and uh, brand awareness will go high. So um, awesome. So uh, let's, let's... We can also speak about maybe... Um, what kinds of the autom difference between automated and yeah, so, uh, videos? Yes, yes. yes. Uh, so, we have if, if a business event. have lots of money, if if you are star or you are not a startup or startup is lots of funding or or a business which have a dedicated amount uh, for creating videos, you can sure go for custom video production. Spend five thousand dollars or three thousand dollars or two thousand dollars for a single animated explainer video. Sure, it will affect better than automated ones because yes. it's created by hand, it's very time consuming, it will spend, uh, you will spend weeks for creating that video and you will have more chances to get a return on investment. Yes, sure. Uh, right. But if you are limited in budget, uh, automated videos nowadays, in the past no, but nowadays automated videos can be very effective as well. You are just spending $30 and the return on the investment will be much faster and easier. So, uh, in both cases, you should de decide your budget. If you, uh, uh, if your budget is low, you can still benefit from automated video production platforms and create a video which will give you um, return on investment back very easily. But if you have lots of money, sure, you can invest and order a custom animated video from a studio, which will have return on investment as well if you are using that video right. So. So startups, uh, startups can start with uh, automated ones, right? Uh, yes, After they have yes. enough budget, they can turn their uh, automated yeah, video into why we decided to launch the platform. Lots of startups uh, didn't have any money for creating uh, yes. explain animation. So we decided why. The most important thing for the startup is explaining their idea. Yeah, and so they uh, didn't have any opportunity to do that. They did text and images which which were uh, which is boring, which is boring and lots of lots of users and uh, cl future clients were not reading it. So while, while creating automated video for just thirty dollars or twenty dollars, they are expanding. They are they are having more chances to get more clients. They are increasing their conversions and growing. In the future, when they will have more budget, they can order a custom animated yes. video. Yes. Also, uh, video effects greatly on uh, social media marketing as well. For example, we have lots of shops, online shops, um, restaurants and uh, other businesses who do create uh, videos regularly. For example, pubs are creating uh, promotional videos for their events regularly and spreading to yes. the uh, social networks. They tell us that it affects on the growth of the ticket sales and growth of the customers because people do like to watch videos and we have also online stores which do post uh, product videos for their each products which also affects on a uh, growth, uh, growth rate. We, we even have DJs um, who tell, uh, s say that when they create a music visualization video surrender for us, they, they have more, uh, their brand awareness rises because they have a professional visualization which yes. is fun to watch or listen. We just help them to uh, with the most important things, explaining their idea and making, um, helping to explain their ideas with a nice, engaging, high quality video. Awesome, awesome. So guys, I guess uh, we have uh, already a deep understanding how videos help your uh, marketing and uh, as a conclusion, uh, Norek, can you please uh, can you please tell the three main elements when we have to decide what kind of videos to create for our startup or business and how to just uh, how to make it to look better just for points uh, as a conclusion for our webinar and we can uh, also well sure before if you are a new startup if you are going to launch a new startup first find your unique selling point from what you differ from the competitors if you are the same thing 
it's very difficult to go in the market. You should find a unique selling point. Why should customers use your product? So first find your unique selling point, then do a good research on what kind of videos do your competitors use on the market to to explain your idea, to explain your startup base idea with ease. Yeah. And finally, start. Don't think that if you don't have any budget, you can't go into the market. When when we started the render for us, we just had a one laptop of investment, and yeah. we don't had an investment, but we started to uh, grow. So, if you act right, if you find your place in the market, if you offer solutions which no one has so far, you will grow. You just need to find the right, uh, right tools and products to help to boost your business. So find your unique selling point, and then try uh, to do good research and create the right type of video and publish, have videos on your website. While having the videos on your website, you have more chances to go viral. That's what I can say. Yes, awesome. Thanks a lot, Norik, for uh, joining our webinar. I guess you guys enjoyed uh, our talk. So uh, we are going to have uh, very interesting webinars uh, each week so the next one we are going to have uh, we will announce about it uh, a little bit later you can follow our page uh, and you'll get uh, the updates about the new webinar so thanks a lot for watching our webinar uh, so we can finish with this so goodbye guys thanks for evening thank goodbye. you to Narek.